now. Feature breaking news time to shot. Wait for two. Six. Take my cue. And of course, we Zero are beginning two. with that breaking news from Fox the Bay Ridge. Cam three, again, camera everyone. five. Stand by to cue over. Mary Beth Marsden. Three people are dead after a crash on the Bay Q Bridge Q on Westbound Lane. Take your boxes. Open shape for Mike Newsroom. Christian Cam five. Is live in the newsroom with all the latest information. Chris. Mary Beth, we just heard you guys Mapping talking H1. to Cheryl Sparks from the MDTA police, and I think the most interesting thing from that conversation was what she spoke about the configuration of the lanes. We keep calling it the westbound lanes of Roy the Bay Bridge, but as you Take. know, a lot of times in frame four is next. We use a live next so frame four. We'll dissolve. From the, the western you got a live? I'll take that, brother. Even Baltimore, back over to their homes on the eastern shore. Dissolve. And with people heading over to the eastern shore beaches. Eventually back to the Schaefer. He'll tag. He'll stand it out. Then a V11 traffic to Fort Chrome Key. On that westbound span that actually heads east. And Cheryl Sparks from the NDTA police. Is she good with the uh, phone or budget? Can you hear the audio? Setup can you? Can you? Can you? Can you? Hang it up. Hang it up. Back to Schaefer, then we do the phoner, guys. I have, I know a lot of our viewers have. As you head east on the on the Bay Bridge and you have those cars heading west, it's it, there's really no divider as you're going east and the traffic's heading west. Was this a head-on collision? Mitch, we'll dissolve back to camera five and two and a two shot for the phoner. investigation right now. All we do know at this time is that three people are dead, several vehicles involved, including at least two tractor trailers. No word on if any other people were injured in the crash, but the traffic certainly in the westbound lanes and also in the eastbound lanes is heavily affected by this deadly crash on the Bay Bridge. If you are planning on using the Bay Bridge tonight, you're asked to call 1-877-BAY-SPAN. That's 1-877-BAY-SPAN to try to get any updates. At this point, Take. it appears that it will be several Two and a two shot is next. They'll do the phoner. And uh, the Mikey, I'll use that right H2 now, for the phoner, buddy. Out a way to get all that traffic off and get some of those people moving again. We're still doing traffic after Christian that, right? Mike, yeah. set. Take right, Chris, you. Thank you. He's talking yeah, about after have, that. Uh, ABC2 News crews in the Stand air open your over phone. the Bay Bridge, also on the ground trying to get to the Bay Bridge. On the phone with us right now is Open ABC your phone or stand by your 8022. You're on Route 50, right? 8802, I'm sorry. Yeah, we were traveling on Route 50 Video. East. We've been driving for about a, a good hour at this point. Right, two. from uh, Southeast Baltimore. We just pulled she over. Sounds like we want to try to pop a live shot. Peak seven's now an H1, Christian. The first four cars. On Route 50, I do Mikey, is this the two-minute tape you got loaded up? Yes, I, well, that's, I was told it was two minutes. All right, cool. Ten miles from the Excuse bridge. Me. That's when we started really running into things. We are now in the thick of things. Stop and go traffic. Let's see if I could use this near the end. Her bumper to bumper traffic. Seven miles, ten miles from the Bay Bridge. Pick up All right, it's two shot to say bye bye to her. Then we're doing VO. To maybe to about 30 miles. But V11 traffic is next. Hitting the brakes and uh, right now. Two shot to V11 traffic. A slow crawl. Should be in that first. All right, man. We are looking right now at our pictures from the helicopter. You can see you just saw an ambulance drive by, heading back out towards the eastern shore because they have cleared it looks like one lane starting to turn some of the backed up traffic around you can already see some of those cars have moved two shot All the traffic has need to get back off the bridge that's what mbta is going to try to do Okay, so by most standards, on the worst day going to the beach on a Friday, on the Memorial Day holiday, Take. this is a your V11 traffic. in case anyone has not heard about it yet, and you know someone who is traveling eastbound on the Bay Bridge, give them a call Stand and help them out before they get to that area to try and avoid that backup. We have the very latest on the traffic Roll situation in traffic track two's Cassandra Spencer. Take. Cassandra, stand by four chroma key. Cassandra. Okay, traffic authority is Dissolve. trying to do a couple things to ease traffic eastbound and westbound. We want to go ahead to a live you look can change. at US 50 at Maryland 8 east of the. All right, when she's done, we're not going to roll her clothes because she is going to burn us. H1 is next off of her. Some of that traffic and first forecast, camera one norm, eastbound. and then he'll do a V11 eastbound to go after all that. To clear way up to no first forecast animation. Two hundred two shots, camera one norm. Two hundred little wrap. Two hundred two shots. Camera one norm. Be stacked for you, as well as 895 from the steel bridge up to 95 and up to the northeast side of the beltway. Mike, set. Thank Zoom, you. take you. Right, Cam one norm is next. Fortunately, weather does not. Yeah, the norm. I'm going to take that, sir. Uh, much no. of a role, if any, in this accident. Let's get the latest Mike, norm. conditions right now. Zoom. From Norm Lewis, take you. Storm Center, Norm. Well, thanks a lot, weather Brian. Is next. The weather was not playing a, a role the way things looked at the time of the accident. However, look at H1. this line of showers and thunderstorms as it comes over. All right, back out to him. He'll do a V11 to go. Moving in our direction. And then and H3. He's reading his to go, in, though, right? So He's reading his weather to go. He's not reading the weather to go now, guys. Back to him, then H3, Mary Beth Mike. Back to him, then H3, Mary Beth Mike. Marjorie, when you get a second, can you jump over those two V11s? So it depends on how long it's going to take him to get that accident scene clear. 
and get things back to normal. But the big thing is that we do Step need H3. the rainfall. It's a dot com, Mary Bethel Reed. Very badly right now. The heaviest what rain what is pictures falling are you up in Pennsylvania, about? and that's the way it's going to continue. What's up, Mary Jam? Now we will see some scattered showers, but exactly. Yeah, we should be. Hopefully, hard to say. Again, have to keep our fingers crossed and hope Mother Nature gives us a blessing. Step H3. We'll talk more about this shower and thunderstorm activity and how long it's going to last. I need a two OTS right, my dear. Two OTS three. Thank you. We have a lot of news to cover tonight. Two OTS right. A P2 breaking to a two OTS right breaking. And on the Bay Bridge, you can yeah, it's my bad. Stand here, P2. ABC2news.com for constant two. updates throughout the night. Take yeah, Mike Ryan. I guess P2 live to Hager and Microwave 1. P2 live, Hager, Microwave 1. trial of a man accused of killing a woman he met through MySpace.com. ABC2 News, Jeff Hager Stand is live P2. in Towson with Probably details on what the Take. jury decided. Open a Microwave Jeff. 1. Well, Brian, life or death is now the only question that Stand remains change. for convicted MySpace killer John You can change. A jury took He's got a VO and H4. deliberating, finding Gomer guilty of first degree murder and rape and the brutal beating death and dismemberment of Josie Brown, a Hamden woman Push Gomer four. had met on the internet. Now in December of 2005, you'll recall Gomer tried to take Brown back to his U.S. Because when he's done, he'll tag and standard out. Date. When she told him to then turn H around, he H5 her off the top. What is dead? To kill her at the I-95 13 is dead, guys. 14 is next. Where he led Hager will tag and standard out in a two and a two shot. Just a three OTS left on the Mary Beth. No two shot for 14. Hey, 13 is dead. Ultimately decide his punishment. Take 14. Three OTS left, Mary Beth. Mike Mary Beth. Take you. All right, guys. P2 exclusive to double boxes. Camera three and. Camera 5, Linda in the newsroom. P2 exclusive, double box, cam 3, cam 5. Warning, the pictures we are about to Stand here, P2. Probably 2. ABC Take. So Center up on 3, open up camera 5, newsroom, Linda. 5 wit. Well, Mary Beth, the dog's Take. owner believes She's got a package H1, and this gets CG2 banners exclusive. Into a dog fight. When this dog won, the suspect stuff. apparently doused the pit bull with hot yeah. grease. Another warning, some of the pictures you're Stand about to see are extremely good. H1, track, take. I don't even want to tell you about 156 it, guys, no food no, or water. 18, 19, 20, dead, dead, and dead. Five. The blending white pit bulls in the yard without tags, no food, water. Tell me, She will stand out, guys. One OTS Rod McNair. P2 team, the box is camp four. Some pictures of the dog on our website at abc2news.com. Just click on the pet section. Yeah, if you can. Mike Bryan. Linda, so ABC2 News. Take you. And now to the P2 story team to the boxes. First on abc2news.com and Good Morning Maryland. Ravens quarterback Steve Stand McNair arrested in Tennessee on an alcohol-related offense. Puppy Tonight, two. we have team coverage. Take. ABC 2 News' Josie Stern. And when we get there, Miss uh, Debbie, you just Tennessee zoom out a little bit. That led to McNair's arrest. Camera but four full is next. ABC 2 Sports Director Scott Garceau with Open Garceau, if you have not. Reaction from Scott. Take. Uh, Brian, NFL do a little zoom out. He's got a CGSS 12, guys. Like this. Brian Billick you can lose. With McNair today. Team President you can change. CGSS 12 wiping the H2. This afternoon. Part of it read, Steve was not arrested for drinking or driving the car irresponsibly. There is a court process that will now take place. As for Stand McNair, by your screen. he released this statement. Take. I was trying H2 to is next. We'll wipe to that. Then camera four to say to bye-bye to Scotty. Process now. Eventually, a two OTS left. V11 investigators to, to camera three, Josie. For most of the remainder of this month to work with my teammates and anticipate Stand H2. that I will be doing Royce that. Two. It's right. not McNair's first brush All right, back out to Scotty. He will tag. Ago, he will stand out in a two OTS left. McNair. V11 investigators, camera three, Josie. An illegal gun possession. The charges were dismissed. The judge ruling police Ready, didn't have four. sufficient reason to pull him over. Take. Steve McNair is no Pac-Man Two OTS Jones, left is next. With the NFL's new crackdown on Plus, you just give me the, the, the Josie name. Biggest Thanks, fear dude. might be a McNair suspension. More on that coming Mike up Marbeth. later in sports. Take you. All right, so how can the this happen? 11 investigators to camera McNair three, Josie. Steve driving the car when it was pulled over, so we wanted to know how Stand he by could 11. be charged with DUI. Our newest Take. ABC 2 News Open up Josie, camera Josie three. Josie Sturman joins us with more on the Tennessee law that makes it all possible. She's got a package Tennessee. H3. This Mary gets CG2. four twos. states in the U.S. have a law like the one that landed McNair in all this trouble. Now, that law basically says the owner of a car is just as responsible as the person driving him when it comes to a DUI charge. But a local attorney says that three. argument is quite a stretch. Push three. Track. Take. 123, guys. Scary, th Steve scary to think about that. Five. Five. Think about that. Camera McNair three, Josie. Getting a raw deal. It's very draconian. It's, it's scary to think about that. Take my cue. 
Robinson she's going to tag. She's going to stand her out. Frame four is next with the bump music, both the mics, and then camera one norm. Breathalyzer test, which McNair and his brother-in-law both refused. Now, here in Maryland, that refusal alone will likely cost you your license for 120 days, even if you're never convicted. Mike is set. Sturman, ABC 2 News. Frame four wit. Take Thanks, two Jesse. music. Still ahead of course. Camera one norm is next. Breaking news from the Bay Bridge. Live pictures right now. Three people killed in a serious accident that, as you can see, has Mike traffic norm. backed up. Backed up in both directions. A live update straight ahead.